Are you dating a Taurus? That's right. Did you meet somebody and you want to pursue a relationship with someone that falls under the zodiac sign Taurus? My name is Maria Romano and I am a dating coach in Las Vegas, Nevada. And I have people that ask me questions from all over the world. Hey, is it important to know about somebody's zodiac sign? And do they have to be compatible? Well, when you meet somebody, you want to find out everything about them, right? You want to know what makes them tick, what makes them work, what their hot buttons are, what their likes are, what their dislikes. By taking the time and spending time and doing some research about their zodiac sign will give you a lot more insight. It'll be valuable because you know how you'll be able to handle them emotionally mentally, spiritually, you'll know a little bit about their love language and how they communicate. And you wanna succeed in the dating world, right? And if there's somebody you like, you wanna pursue that relationship. So it's important to understand a little bit about this new person that's coming into your life and their zodiac sign. Now, if you like this video, thumbs up. And remember to listen to the end because I'm gonna give you some great information about the Taurus. Well, the Taurus is an earth sign. It is a grounded sign. It's the bull, right? You met somebody and they are like a bull. They stand tall. They are proud, male or female. When that, even though we know that the bull is a male, but the thing is there are females that fall under the Taurus sign. They are very proud, proud individuals. And they are proud with everything they do. And they want somebody in their life who's by their side that's just as proud. So you need to have lots of confidence when you're in a relationship with the Taurus. That's important. No insecurities here. They like individuals that are strong because they are strong people. They lead. They like to lead. They don't like to be led. And that's important because what will happen is that stubbornness, that's what the bull is like, that stubbornness will set in. So what you need to do is there's something that you want, something that you're interested in, and you have a relationship with the Taurus and you don't know how to broach it. I'm going to share with you a little tip. Broach it after the two of you have been intimate and you're lying down in bed or wherever you're at and have what I call pillow talk because pillow talk is powerful. And it's very powerful with the Taurus. So if you want something from a Taurus, remember to strategize and do it properly when they're their most vulnerable and their most loving. That's right. The same thing as you've heard of the bull in the china shop, the same thing with the Taurus. They are stubborn. So remember that if there's something you really want, you're going to have to just learn how to work with them. But they're great leaders. They are fabulous with finances. So if you're looking for that stability in your life, this is a great person. And also, a Taurus wants to hear. They want to hear that you love them. That's one of their love languages. They want you to hear and they also want you to do things for them. So if you want to pursue a great relationship with a Taurus in your life, this information will definitely help you. And if you are looking for any more dating tips and want to find out more about dating in the world today and about dating the different zodiac signs, please subscribe to my YouTube channel, Maria at truelovenuts.com. I'm also on social media uh, under Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram, I would love to hear from you. I would love to hear about your successes in the dating world. I want to hear about any challenges, any great dates that you've had, and any dates that were very interesting. I'd like you to share them with me because I have a passion. I want to help people get ready to find love again. And I want you to succeed so you find the perfect person for you. Happy dating.